Hey YouTube, what's up? Thanks for tuning in. I want to show you this tiny little piece, this awesome, super cheap piece, which makes it possible to bind a Spectrum satellite receiver without the use of a normal receiver with satellite plug. I did already buy this somewhere in last year, I guess. It's called iRange X, but Luckily, I didn't have to use it, but some time ago now, some weeks ago, my Oxy2 cube came down. I don't really know why, so I changed the satellite receiver. Maybe it was the satellite receiver. And now I used it for the first time, and it works awesome. Before, I always had to use a standard receiver. Of course, you couldn't use it in another model, which has a satellite plug. You had to use uh, your bind plug and power up the receiver. And with this super cheap little thing, you only need a micro USB plug and 5 volt micro USB. So it has a micro USB plug here, female. And it has a 3 pin 1.5 plug here as the satellites normal use also comes with this cable so you do not have to remove the satellite cable from your heli and also comes with a quite puzzling manual but it works so easy you do not need a manual at least if you do you want to bind a dsmx satellite so simply plug this in your satellite receiver and plug a 5 volt micro USB in and you see the satellite receiver is in bind mode and now binding DSMX 22 extremely fast no problems you know the problems uh, when you complete. when you normally bind uh, DSMX or Spectrum receivers or satellites and the transmitter is not is too near, sometimes bind fails. I tried it many times now, never failed. Extremely fast, and everything's okay. I did already change the set, so that's a new set in this Oxy2 now, and. It works, so I didn't have to change anything in the flyballer system. That's a micro spirit in there. Absolutely awesome. And you can also bind DSM-2 satellites with this tiny thing. Before binding in DSM-2, you have to press this button when powering the bind module up. Wait a little bit. And now it should be in DSM2 mode. Binding. DSM2 22 milliseconds 1024 resolution. And bind complete. Now I have bound this DSM-2 satellite receiver and if I want to go back to DSM-X mode again, I can plug it out, keep the button pressed, pushed, there are some whatever lights and now it should be in DSM-X mode again. Binding. DSMX 22 milliseconds. And now it's in DSMX mode again. Bind complete. This tiny little thing is awesome. It's so much easier than before and now I can use this receiver for a plane or any other model. And best, it's absolutely crap cheap. This should be 
delivered with the satellite receivers. So if you don't have one yet, I highly recommend to buy this three, four, five bucks, nearly nothing and so much easier. That's it guys. I hope this tiny sucker will be in air soon again and work again. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. I'll be back.